We're getting organized because we have bugs on the set. <laughs> it's uh, going to be really fun. We're going to get right to it. Uh, Larry Yarns with Aaron Muffaletto, our guest, Colleen McRoberts uh, with uh, Bernalillo County. Good to have you back. And Mike Sanchez is here. And Mike, what do you do with the... Uh, you're with the Biopark or what? No, I'm actually with the New Mexico Museum of Natural History. Okay, I'm, I'm an sorry. educator there. Good. And you brought the bugs. I brought the bugs, yes. <laughs> now, this is about calling creepy, yeah, crawly night. Exactly. So on Sunday, um, we are going to have from 1 o'clock to 3 o'clock creepy crawlies for families. It's a free open space event at Bekeke Open Space. And um, we're going to be getting into the Halloween spirit the naturalist way and just learning about all the cool things that Mike Sanchez has brought uh, today. And Mike did another program for us earlier uh, in the year, Hippity Hoppity Herps. Mm -hmm. I have to tell you, it was so fun watching these uh, parents and their kids getting excited about these animals together, learning. And uh, Mike is a wonderful educator, so we learned a ton. And again, this is free and people can register at our website. Let's get to the bugs. I know, uh, I'm excited. <laughs> uh, let's show him first. This is a centipede, obviously. This is a centipede. This is Zeus. This is Zeus the centipede. Zeus the centipede. Now, we're going to try and get a shot here, Paul. Let's see if we can get a good picture. Um, see how that I works. did ask if I could hold it, can but they you? wouldn't let me. So. Not the centipede. <laughs> <laughs> it may not end well. Would you, yeah. Is that going to work like that? Let's see. Where would you like him, Paul? Right there. Yeah, we're not going to pick him up. <laughs> it looks like because he's coming out. No, this guy, is, I, and he will get out. He's a he's a big critter. Let's see. Is, is that going to work? He's not a small centipede. No. Right, right here. Yeah. This Let's see. I don't right know here. where that. Zeus goes. is a fitting name. Zeus. So what's uh, Zeus's story? Well, Zeus actually is kind of neat. Uh, you remember that we had a lot of um, rain earlier this year, uh -huh. and Zeus was actually at the um, at the uh, veteran center. Uh, I had these people who called me up, and they said that they had a centipede for me. So I said, okay, well, a centipede, and I'm used to, you know, little centipedes. And uh, here comes this, um, this, there's this bottle, a Coke bottle, uh -huh. in my office. And the centipede, and it was so big it couldn't turn around, so I had to end, cut off the end of the bottle in order to get him out. Oh. So, uh, and that was Zeus. <laughs> so, and there we've had is. Yeah, and Zeus is enormous. I mean, that's the biggest that one I think insane. I've ever seen. <laughs> I thought maybe this was shipped into Albuquerque, but you actually found this here. It, that's this is right here. In, right yeah, here. He'll in bite town. you, right? He'll hurt in you. Town. They will. Yes, they are venomous. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, what you else can you got? see his little. What are those guys? Mm -hmm. oh, these are these are Madagascar hissing cockroaches, and these guys Lovely. are. Lovely. These are these are <laughs> actually kind of cool. These oh, okay. guys you can carry. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, we have camera right over here. Okay, so I want you to. Yeah, these are these are hissing cockroaches. And uh, we have actually one is named Leroy, and the other one is named Hiss. You hold there you go. Yeah. That's, oh. Oh, hi, buddy. that's Leroy. There, hey, there's Leroy. Leroy. How's it going? And let's get out <laughs> Hiss here. Hold him out for Chris to take a shot he's of He's actually there. really cute when you look up close. No. There you go. <laughs> he, he's got like little bug eyes. And Can these guys see? are so handled so often that they rarely hiss anymore, although when they do hiss, it's kind of, let's see if we can get one to hiss. Okay. That means they're... Angry. Defending themselves, right? It's their only, pretty much their only defense is to make themselves sound kind of scary. Yeah. <laughs> Look at that. Yeah, that's kind of cool. It's I a know big in bug. The, in that some is countries, a very big they bug. actually will eat cockroaches. Yes. Not these ones, though. This is a species that's edible. It is. Ah. Absolutely. I know. In some places, they call them rice bugs. Oh, they stuff them full of rice. No. Yeah. Yeah. Rice bugs, that's a, a great name, huh? Mm -hmm. I don't know yeah, how anybody feels about having that for <laughs> I don't think I would <laughs> eat that for dinner. If you no. were really hungry. <laughs> yes. It, you'd have to be we, very hungry. We just have another minute or so. Let's bring okay. out another bug. Well, Who, what do you want to show? I would like to. Let's see if we can get out our tarantula. Where is it? Let's get a tarantula. Oh, he's missing. Larry, he's on your shoe. Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's a little guy. This is a little one, yeah. Okay. This is the common species that we oh. have here in New Mexico. Uh, these are very common. We're not sure if this is a boy or a girl yet, although uh, there are some suspicion that it's a boy, in which case it'll, they only live about 10 to 12 years. If it's a girl, they can live a long time. I mean, they up to 30 years. Wow. Uh, these ones are the ones that people see migrating, or the supposed migration. Um, I've heard of these guys walking, uh, the males, up to 50 miles. Uh, I guess they put a tracking device on one and saw how far it would walk. 50 miles. Creepy crawlies. Feet. 